this project is a do-it-yourself using readily off-the-shelf components. The rotor or moving part is a front wheel disc brake hub assembly with stub axle supplied by arccorporation.com worldwide auto parts supplier at low cost. The disc pad surface is ideal to attach our magnets. The assembly is complete with bearings and with the iron con content supports the magnetic flux required to cut across the copper wires used in the coils. The magnets are rare earth permanent magnets. The number required is calculated with the formula number of coils times 1.33 this alternator is using 12 coils, the stub axle side, 15 coils, the wheel side. Therefore, the stub axle side, 12 coils, times 1.33 is approximately 16 magnets. The nearest hole number will be good. We do not cut magnets in small pieces. The size is 25 mils diameter by 5 mils thick, strength N42. The wheel side of the hub will have 15 coils times 1.33 is approximately 20 magnets. The size is 20 mils diameter by 2.5 mils thick, strength N42. This alternator will have two stators with coils connected in three phase with the alternating voltage or pulsed voltage combining at a common rectifier circuit using 12 diodes to produce DC voltage. This design is used to maximize the output for every rotation and to stay at the low RPM side for a usable DC voltage output with current to charge storage lead acid batteries. The magnets are glued in place. Once the spacing between each is equal, the disc assembly is 10 inches or 25 centimeters in diameter. The disc pad surface is two and a quarter inches or six centimeters. The glue used is medium strength to allow moving components if an error occurs. At the end of assembly, we will go back and permanently glue all components. The magnets are rare earth permanent magnets which are highly corrosible, so are covered in nickel. They are easily broken or chipped. Please take care. Part 2 is stator assembly coil windings.